Hello everyone and welcome to the 15th electronics tutorial. In this tutorial we will explore logic gates. Logic gates are used in digital electronic circuits and produce a logical zero signal or logical one signal based on the inputs they receive. Where an analog signal can vary in voltage and amplitude, a digital signal only varies between two states a high signal and a low signal. A high signal is represented by a 1 and a low signal is represented by a 0. The earliest form of digital communication was made by the telegraph machine. The machine would produce a dot or dash signal that would be sent down the line as electrical pulses then received by another machine a long distance away. The dots and dashes would be interpreted by the receiving operator and translated into words. Modern electronic devices, such as computers, smartphones and tablets, all use digital electronics. For example, when data is sent from one computer to another, the information is broken down into data packets then the receiving computer reassembles them. The computer's processor is made up of millions of logic gates combined together to process all the incoming information. We will begin by looking at each logic gate individually and then in later videos we will combine the logic gates together to produce circuits used in digital devices. All the digital logic gates are available in every circuit. They are AND, OR, NOT, NAND, NOR, XOR and XNOR. <laughs> 